Melissa. In this video, I'm gonna give you a little trick when you are printing on your Roland BN20 or BN20A. So if you are used to going into VersaWix, VersaWorks and picking the quality of your print and you're wondering, hmm, should I pick standard? Should I pick high speed? Should I pick draft one, draft two? What should I pick? Well, I gotta tell you something. After printing something that took 250 some odd minutes, I realized I could have probably cut that time down in half with very, very limited quantity reduction. That makes no sense, but hopefully you get what I'm saying. Basically the same quality at half the time. Okay. So here's the thing. I printed these diff These are obviously the same decal. One is printed on standard and one is printed on draft. And I got to tell you, when you look at them close up, even when you look at them close up, you can barely tell the difference. And even for this very small decal, one took five minutes and one took nine minutes. So when you put that at scale and you're, and you're printing something that has, you know, you have dozens and dozens of logos or stickers or heat transfers, and you're trying to cut your time in, in half or cut your time down uh, significantly so that you can A, print more, get to cutting, increase your production one of the things that you can do is actually print in draft even when it's not a draft and honestly unless you are using like a microscope it's extremely difficult to see much of a difference okay between that and standard so it saves a lot of time and you really can't tell so next time you're considering how can i speed up this job am i going to sacrifice quality for time really when you look at it closely and i did this test and i'm going to show you a closer look you're going to tell you're going to be able to tell that really it's worth just printing in draft.